I tried to contact, bro. Well, I did. But a nigga fake gave me, I don't know, nigga fake gave me the shoulder. Then I oh. seen, then I seen he had took another out. So now nah, I don't fuck with that nigga. Oh, that's crazy. There was something in Fort Worth and like, he was came to the bar and shit, did a little walkthrough or whatever. I'm like, yo, Trippy, fuck with young boy. Y'all need to get on back on that music shit for real. He was just laughing. He just looked at it and laugh type shit. Yeah. He lied though. Uh, that's how a lot of niggas be though, man. Nigga ain't never in their life had a problem with me, but it seemed like nobody liked me, no. Nah, cause all that song called Cut My Ties with my people. That little that video he was in that bitch. Yeah, I thought y'all was live. Y'all was live together. Yeah. It's Roy Stavis on the check-in. I'm actually starting to like NBA Youngboy for real. Like I ain't never really listened to his music like that. I heard a couple of his songs, you know what I'm saying? Some was hit, some was missed. But, you know, his personality, you know what I'm saying, starting to click with me because I'm low-key like that. Like, you know, if the, somebody starts acting funny, I'm extremely quick to cut some shit off, you know what I'm saying? Like, 50 Cent's really the only other person that's, you know, expressed similar views, you know what I'm saying? And sound like NBA is not a big fan of, you know what I mean, trying to make friends in the industry and play fake friends and play politics and shit like that. Like, that's too much work, you know what I'm saying? So... I definitely feel him on this when the city was saying, you know, about Trippy Red, whatever the case may be. Hey, it is what it is. You know, people give you funny vibes or anything like that. You know, it's just better safe than sorry, but that's just my personality type, you know. But the each is on. Of course, if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe.